Once again, this is It's All Life, Who Cares? Now, you notice I'm starting a little bit differently today because I have different armor. So I'm just showing it to you. This is Fysine. Now, you notice that I'm still wearing two parts of my leather armor. It's because some sets of armor only contain contain actually less than five pieces. And this Enfysine is a water type armor, which helps out with my swimming, because today I'm doing Royal Lunaroth. So you see oxygen up, current resist, and Olympic swimmer. And I'm carrying a new weapon. I received, I made this right after I killed the Korapeka after I received a flint stone from capturing him. Now I'm just going to uh might talk a little bit more in this one. Uh so, you're now starting to get a lot, and if you've been listening, you'll start noticing that there are certain catches. Now, I'm just going to start with this. Save our boat. Okay. And see, this is a new area. And now you start requiring to get oxygen packs. Because sometimes you might just stay a little bit too long underwater. And this is the flooded forest. It does not require any drinks. The drinks are more of replaced with Water. And if I'm correct, I should find him in the area four. Now, if you've been watching carefully, I've been marking them the past times because I just want to figure out when I've gotten enough damage on them to capture them. Yet, I'm not going to capture them. Too much really. Now here's the new part. There are breaking parts on the Royal Lunaroth. There are some on the Korapeka, as in his beak and his uh, flint, but on the Royal Lunaroth it's his crest, which you see those little uh, pointy things on the top of his head that are sticking up. Those will come off incredibly easily. And now you notice I'm having some elemental in this. Also, you can cut off their KO fun, which was a brilliant ad, I must say, because it gives you an, another card plus other substances. See, also, the Royal Lunaroth happens to carry a certain, uh, how shall I put this, drug that when mixed in with a well done steak creates a mega dash juice, which makes it so that your stamina cannot be depleted for an amount of time, which is incredibly useful. Also, it makes mega, uh, mega air filter, I believe. That also does it with the air. It, does, it only raises your air. It doesn't uh, make it invulnerable for a while. But that's not really useful. Now you just saw that, well, I don't know, mental breakdown with my controller. That wasn't good. Oh, 
Yeah, uh, forgot to mention. The Royal Luteroth is an easier beat. You just sort of knock him over. He's very fragile. Now I'm just gonna finish the subquest first. So, it's gonna take a little bit longer. Oh yeah, one thing. Wyvern tears are from breaking certain parts or just weakening them a little, which is why it gets incredibly annoying. So no, funny little armor set, isn't it? Yeah, after you complete some quests, you get items. It, re it replenishes at the bottom and gives you something. Oh yeah, you went back on land. You got a cheery sight. Sorry about the hold up with the sub quest, just more get some more items. Oh, this is a another monster I should have mentioned. Epia. They're just herbivores. Don't do anything unless of course when you attack their friends and if you kill them first their other friends will come back and hurt you. Oh, well, isn't that a good sight? Oh, that's even better. Looks sort of like a morning. If I please, can you put some comments in the section about what do you think about the armor? Because I'm just currently trying this out. I'm an armor collector, and making these videos sort of reminded me I have to continue my sets. Also the fact you're sort of costing me money with all the making of new tools. He's sleeping in this area? What? What? I thought he was an Area 8 guy. Unusual. It would be a nice thing to get, but some things are to get. Oh yeah, you also noticed that I have a different variety of attacks. I believe Sword is the only one that has that happening. the area he sleeps in. Now for the first time you're going to see one of the monsters fall asleep. Most people prefer capi uh, capturing 
that I knack it for when he's sleeping because he is a very fierce predator uh, enemy. So yeah, here's the sleeping imbecile. And there's that extra. Might take a while. And thank you for watching another video.